<laughs> so um i think that's very important um sometimes you know we have a plan with the saying you want to make god laugh tell him your plan and there, life like they say life be life and things are going to happen you have to learn how to pivot but sometimes when you have your plan and your plan b what can you do you may have a plan c and that's we have to learn how to be flexible be resourceful or just say hey babe, maybe this wasn't for me in the beginning and i need to find another route or open another or, or look for another door That's important what you just said about, you know, identifying doors. Let's we can call it that identifying doors. Cause I think sometimes let me not say sometimes, because then you, you you're speaking it about yourself. So up until now, I've been working on this with my therapist. Up until now, we sometimes be like, oh, that's a door that we thought, you know, we're gonna walk in, or that's a door that we thought that was gonna happen, or we thought it was gonna happen like this, and I call the door that. But then that's like when you really sit back, was that really the door for you? Or maybe that door closed for a reason. Maybe that door, you know, maybe there was some stuff behind that door that was not for you. Maybe there was some stuff, you know, that was gonna bite eat you alive that you didn't need. And then there's other open doors that if you allow God to give you the correct gift and you receive it, it, it allows you to flourish. So yeah, yeah I'm glad about, about doors. <laughs> I think 